is Kendall Hope Tucker, and I'm the founder and CEO of Polis. I have a question for you. When you see a TV ad or an internet pop-up, how does it make you feel? Do you trust the ad? Do you remember it the next day? Probably not. Because you, like me, are distracted by 10 other things. You're worried about what happened at work, and you'd much rather get back to this. Well, there's a problem with that. As your viewership of ads has gone down, pricing for these ads has gone up. You just don't feel the connection. So how do I get your attention? You're most likely to respond to and remember a sales pitch if it's made in person. There's a trust that comes from looking someone in the eye, listening to what they care about, and engaging with them about their product or solution. But how do you make in-person meetings at scale? I'll give you a hint. It used to look something like this, and now it looks like this. Door-to-door -door sales is back, and it's better than ever. In the last five years, as the economy has rebounded, door companies that make complex and costly sales have turned once again to door-to-door. -to -door. This is now a $70 billion industry that spends $2.9 billion on software and services. The problem is that companies still think about it like this. They knock every door, they record their responses on paper, and they just don't quite get around to analyzing their results to ensure a return on investment. That's where we come in. Polis started in politics, where door-to-door -door outreach is the difference between going to the White House and going home. Our platform, which makes door-to-door -door outreach targeted, easy, and effective, has so far been used by 80 campaigns, including two presidential races, to knock over 100,000 doors. So what do we do different? This is easiest to explain with a case study. One of our clients has 30 sales reps who bring in about $3 million per year. When they first came to Polis, they were using software that looked like this. It's not pretty. What this meant is that their sales reps were spending two hours a day deciding who to talk to and how to get there. Then their solar company, but they were knocking at every door, meaning they were spending time talking to the 74% of Americans who cannot buy solar. And because they made commission, their sales reps were frustrated and quitting about 90% of the time. So this is what we show them. Polis starts by identifying households likely to buy your product or solution. For solar companies, we identify households in the sun with high credit scores and stable income. Here in Boston, excluding condos, we found 21,000 targeted leads. Next, we give organizations a platform that lets them decide who can sell for them and how they are going to direct them. Lastly, and most excitingly, their sales reps see this. They log into our app, iOS or Android, scroll to their assigned region, and click Get Started. Polis generates an optimized walking route that tells them where to go, who to talk to, and what to say. This is coordination and planning that used to take organizations two to four hours per cancer per day, all done now at the click of a button. So how's it been going? In the last two months, since, since expanding from politics to door-to-door -door sales, we've signed organizations in all five of these spaces. More exciting than that, we signed the number two largest solar company in the country. So, our aim is to better connect people with the organizations they care about, and we're getting it. I'm happy to take any questions that you might have here or out there, but 
just remember, opportunity is not. Thank you so much. 